Hey internet, it is Adam for realhomerecording.com. If you record with virtual instruments and Kakos Reaper, this video is a must watch. There's a feature that you may not be aware of that could change your recordings for the better. It's called Preserve PDC Delayed Monitoring in Recorded Items. By default, Reaper thinks that you are timing your notes perfectly to the metronome, aka the click track. If you monitor with your keyboard's built-in sounds or a real guitar amplifier, then this works perfectly fine. However, if you use virtual instruments that are monitored through your DAW, you may find your playback timing is off. When monitoring audio through the DAW, some musicians adjust their note timing to play slightly early. By default, Reaper shifts the MIDI notes back in time after you stop recording. This behavior may explain what happened to me when I nailed the rhythm of my direct keyboard samples but was all over the place with the virtual drums. Then again, I just might be a bad player. Anyway, yes, it was very annoying for me at the time and I wish I knew about this feature back then. So, how do you change it? It's really simple. Right click on Record Enable and find the option right here. Then left click it. And then if I right click again, you'll see that it now has a check mark next to it. That's all you gotta do. To show you exactly what this does, if you still don't understand what I'm saying, I'll record two different tracks. This one on the bottom does not have PDC enabled, as you can see. So I'll play a few notes on the MIDI keyboard and be back. Okay, I'm going to zoom in now so you guys can see what I'm talking about here. You see how the bottom track, the note is forward, and on this track, it is a little bit to the right. So yeah, now this was recorded at 512 because for some reason my screen capture software has issues with anything less than this for some reason. But even at lesser buffer settings, this can still be an issue, timing being just slightly off can cause problems. So, if you want, what you hear is what you get, which for me was the option I wanted to have, then that's what you need to set. Again, right click record enable, and then right there, preserve PDC. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that bell notification button so you don't miss a single new video. This has been Adam for realhomerecording.com.